How's the lighting over here? This is pretty good. This is some, some nice lighting over here. Ooh, the sun just came out. Okay, maybe I'll just film it right here. What up YouTube and welcome back to my channel. My name is Sahila and today we're gonna be doing a small bathroom makeover. Essentially, this bathroom is just so outdated and it is screaming for help. So we are gonna be replacing the countertops and painting the Malamine cupboards. I'm also going to opt in for an undermount sink instead of whatever this gross thing is. Also, it has those like old school crystal Bob Fawcett handles, which are just so gross. So I'm totally getting rid of those. I've actually already bought something new from Canadian Tire. Um, I went with a quartz countertop with an undermount sink. So essentially what we're gonna do is be repainting the cupboards in that beautiful sage green color that everyone is obsessed with, including myself. Painting Malamine is actually not that hard and it's a great way to give something that's completely outdated new life. So if you're curious in how to paint Malamine, it's super easy by the way. It's so easy. <laughs> Keep watching. When you're starting a project like this, the first thing you want to do is prep your space. I like to put some cardboard down to protect the floor and remove any hardware. In this case, both the hinges and doors need to be removed. I tried to remove the fake drawers as well, but the sink was in the way and I was unable to get in there to remove them with my drill, so I just left them attached. Next, I sanded the Malamine vanity down using 120 grit sandpaper and my sanding mouse. You want to roughen up the surface so that the primer paint adheres well, but you don't want to over sand it to the point where you start to dull the corners or ruin the surface. In places I couldn't get into with my sanding mouse, I went in by hand and used some sanding paper. After you are done sanding, take a damp cloth and wipe the whole vanity down. While the vanity dries, repeat those three steps with the doors, making sure to sand down and wipe the sides of the vanity doors as well. Once everything is dry, you can start with your first coat of paint. I like to paint one side and three of the four edges of each door piece first, letting it dry for 12 hours before returning and doing the opposite side and final edge. I used a small foam roller on the doors and a mix of a roller and brush on the vanity. I purchased one quart of Benjamin Moore Styx Waterborne Bonding Primer for this project and it was more than enough. After both sides have been primed and given time to dry, I'm then going to do two coats of Benjamin Moore Advanced Interior Paint in Semi-Gloss in my October Mist color, which is that sage green color I mentioned that is super popular right now. As for the doors, I do the same technique of painting one side and three of the four edges before leaving them to dry for 12 hours and returning to do the other side and last edge. Once you get two color coats on both the vanity and doors and everything has fully dried, you can then go ahead and reinstall your doors. After I finished painting the vanity, the new quartz countertop with the undermounted sink went in along with the new faucet from Canadian Tire and voila, my bathroom makeover is complete. guys so that's all i have for you today i think this project turned out amazing i freaking love that sage green color and i think it goes so well with the new quartz countertop i think i paid 450 dollars for the quartz countertop and it came with that undermounted sink already which was amazing and then the faucet from canadian tire was under 100 bucks so in total i think i spent with the paint and everything and the, the paint brushes or whatnot under 600 bucks for this small bathroom makeover and it looks so amazing i can't even believe it so i'm really happy with the results and i hope you guys enjoyed this video and learning how to paint malamine if you have any questions feel free to leave them in the comments below if you like this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and i'll see you guys again next time bye